Radio 710 Keel is your news and weather station. Would you take a moment, Watson, yes. and introduce our two next guests, friends and compatriots of yours? Yes, I would like to introduce, and this is this is not something that you, you get to say very often, but I would like to introduce you to the entire cast of Stage Center's next production. The name of the play is called Red. Right. And this is Jim Coles and Daniel Salazar. Jim Coles plays Mark Rothko, the artist, and Daniel plays his assistant, Ken. Gentlemen, welcome. Now, I don't know much. I know I've seen a lot of Stage Center stuff, and it's awesome, but I, I, we're meeting for the first time, and I'm unfamiliar with the play, but luckily, Gary who is a member of the Stage Center repertoire. Repert Ooh, that was good. Yeah. Repertory group right. uh, has written for me a couple of questions. Uh, so the first one is, what's it like working with an awesome talent like Gary Watson? <laughs> it, it's, it's probably one of the hardest things I've ever done. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You handle this one, man. You know these guys really well. You know about the play. You can, you can get from them knowledge that I... Uh, you take over. Well, uh, uh, the, the play is, is about Mark Rothko, the artist, but it's about a specific time in his life. Uh, Jim, can you kind of tell us a little bit about your character and what he goes through during the show? Yep, I play Mark Rothko, who is the greatest uh, abstract expressionist uh, in the mid-century, 1940s, 1950s. Uh, and he was commissioned to design a series of murals in New York City for the Four Seasons Restaurant, which is still, still in existence. Uh, in the Seagram building uh, in New York. It was the biggest commission ever given in the art world, uh, multi-million dollars in this uh, day's money. And um, so the play's about his uh, determination to do that uh, and the, the troubles and uh, problems that he had reconciling being a, a, a great artist with designing uh, art for what is a commercial uh, enterprise for a restaurant, mm -hmm. uh, which was sort of demeaning in a way to him. And so the plays about art, uh, they are the, the act of creation and uh, the, the mental and physical problems. What do you like most about the part? What, what, what made you gravitate to this when you, uh, when you took this? It's it? written by uh, John Logan, who's a brilliant playwright, and the script is, is absolutely awesome. Uh, it's funny. It's sad, it's scary, it's brilliant. It's got everything in it in a small play, just the two of us. And um, so it's it's absolutely a, a great, great work of art. Daniel, Stage Center, it's going to be at First United Methodist again, I would assume, the Emmett Hook. No, no, no. no this, this one will actually be at the East Bank Theater, the Bossier Arts Council, like gotcha, right down the street from the gotcha. horseshoe. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Okay, give us some run dates and ticket info and tell us about your part uh, in the play. So we open uh, February 12th. Uh, we run for two weekends. So uh, we do a Friday, sa Saturday um, on February 12th and 13th at 7.30 and a Sunday on the 14th of February at 3 p.m. And then uh, the following weekend, we're February 19th at 7.30. And then a uh, double show on Saturday on the 20th at 2 p.m. and 7.30. Is it, so. is it stagecenter.com? Stagecenterla.com. I mm -hmm. thought that was right. Okay. And tickets go on sale Monday. Monday. Yeah, box office opens Tell Monday. us a little about uh, about your part in the play. And are, are you the director also? No, 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 no. Actually, just I just do the lights for this one and a minute. So uh, uh -huh. Jared Watson, who usually directs most of our shows, is directing this one. He's brilliant at this one. And it's a lot easier for this one since it's just a two man show. Is so. two man show is it 50-50? Is it 60-40? Is um, it 90-10? Man, it's it's kind of it's kind of crazy. I would say it's about, you know, maybe 60-40. Uh you know, uh Jim here has a, a lot of lines. Um I got a good bit of lines too. It's a, a lot of weight for the both of us, but uh as, as the show goes on, I I, I kind of make my voice known towards the end of the show. Mm -hmm. And I, I think that's something great about this show. Um you know, I come in as like a, a job interview. Uh, to be his assistant, I, and I kind of get it right off the bat, and we, we start working, and, you know, I learn a lot uh, about Rothko, and a lot from uh, Rothko, you know, he teaches me about what art means to him, and, and, and as the show goes on, I kind of, you know, teach him about what art means to me, and what art might mean to, to most people, and not just what he thinks, you know, well, so we, we learn off. Oh. Historically, the stuff you guys do at Stage Center, absolutely awesome. By the way, yeah. Daniel is the resident lighting designer for Stage Center, so he designed the lights for Jesus for Christ Superstar. Superstar. Mm -hmm. He designed the lights for absolutely well, brilliant, thank you, by thank the way. You. And, uh, and also in this show, there's live art. You guys yeah, are, that's, are that's painting. That's the one thing I love about this show is, you know, uh, there's a lot of things happening that are, are uh, 
for us on a, on a purely tangible level, it's very exciting as an actor because, you know, you're mixing paints, you're building canvases, you're stretching canvases all the way up to priming canvases, which is exciting for us and I, not only exciting for us, but I think it'll be exciting for audience members Apologies, as well. Apologies, boys, up against the time here. Daniel, Jim, Stage Center, the play is read. All details and ticket information online at Stage Center. LA.com and if uh, past his prologue it will be absolutely brilliant.